Alaska was inches away from victory in Game 5, but instead now find themselves one defeat away, from another PBA Finals loss. At the center of it all was Kevin Rackle, who came inches, away from grabbing the loose ball, or at the very least tapping it out of bounds, and away from the hands of eventual Magnolia game hero Paul Lee. With the clock winding down, Rackle, dived for the ball following a crucial block by Mike Harris on Romeo Travis Drive. Unfortunately, Rackle, was beaten to the ball by Lee who hit the wide open baseline jumper to give Magnolia a, 79-78 win. A few possessions prior to Lee's game winner, Rackle also missed a layup on a 3-on-1 break that would have also handed Alaska a 4-point lead. Instead, Ian Sangalang scored on a 3-point play on the other end. Alaska coach Alex Compton, however, declined to pin the blame on Rackle and instead lauded him for his effort in Game 5. You make a layup and we are up by 4. I don't blame our guys. I'm not angry at it. We are all disappointed. Get a layup, miss, get a layup, miss, they go down and hit a 3-point play. That kinda changes everything, said Compton. On the possession that led to Lee's game winner, Compton said, I thought Mike was phenomenal defensively at the end. You've got a big block on Romeo. It looked like we are good. And then, k rax got us four or five loose balls for diving in that game. I thought k rax was awesome. And he dove and that one was an inch out of his grasp. What happens if when k rax dives to get the ball, his arm grew two inches? And he bats it down court? Then I'm your first interview, in the post-game press conference, and, not Chito. Victoloro, Compton said. Compton said no team should be disappointed about the effort in Game 5. There's things that we can clean up but neither team, whether fans or families should be disappointed with that effort, Compton said.